And here we go again. I'd like to just show you more of a fun thing than anything really important. I did a search on the internet uh, recently for um, <coughs> a clock, a desktop clock. Because look, mine's gone missing. Well, I took it away. So I went onto a, the, a website. Let me just see if I can retrace my steps a little bit. And it's. Um, no need to put it in there actually, I can put it into the proper side so we go so soft. Where? Okay. Dot, dot com. And get rid of the uh, bit that popped up after I started typing. There we go. Here's uh, softwareok.com. Okay Easy name to remember. So th there's lots of things plenty of stuff to uh, to see on the page here and, and different things and different ideas that the guy has and I can't even see what I'm looking for it's a desk clock desk here it is here on the third third of January 2017 the the aero clock um, we click on that this is what it looks like and it's just a, as I say it's not a serious thing it's just a fun thing uh, we can do a direct download it's only just over a meg big so it's not the massive program which we can download which I've already done so we don't have to do that again if I go to downloads it comes in zip form so if I click on there and extract all we end up with this arrow clock here there's also an any file and if we click on it and run it let's close that window I have already set this up as you can see it sort of comes about like here and we end up with this clock and it also comes uh, in lemon I think is a default setting there we go and that's what it looks like but it's because it's clever um, if we can go to different we can have a silver clock or we can have a gold clock even a bit more expensive or we can have the gold too which is the one I actually quite prefer again it can be very obnoxious if I just move the panel over a little bit we'll leave that there we can actually move the clock quite freely and if I uh, wanted it centered on the fox, um, I could do that as well just by manipulating the uh, size slider there. And I can have it o over the fox's face. I can also vary the transparency. You can make it just barely visible or slightly more visible. Depends on what you want. I mean, you may not even want it on there. Okay, so you don't want it there, but hey, it'd be nice to have it. Let's have it up the corner somewhere. So we can get right, take it right down to the smallest size possible and literally click on the center of the clock and you can move it quite freely to where you want it. That's that's about it, that's all it does. You can have it always on top, but I'd, I'd, if, you, if you're into writing um, stories and that sort of thing or reading emails, you don't want that sticking over the top of half your words. But it's up to you. If you want it always on top, that's fine. You can have it. the clock start with windows. Um, you can also fix it in that position, which is, um, is it's good so that if you catch it with um, you catch your mouse pointer on it and drag as I do occasionally. Uh, I know lots of people have a similar um, problem; they just catch the mouse wrong and it drags everything over. Right, so you can also have it in the centre of the screen just by clicking the button there. You have to be pretty precise on the small version um, as to where. Okay. <laughs> Take the box out, fixed in that position. Forgot to do that. See how easy it is just to make a fool of yourself. I do it regularly. There we are. <laughs> That's it. Um, you can fix it in that position, which is good, which is what was happening wrong. When I clicked centre of the screen, it was fixed in that position, so I couldn't move it. But uh, yeah, it does move quite freely. And you can move it to anywhere and have it always on top, as I say. It would be nice, um, and here's, here's one just for the uh, manufacturer of the clock here, or the maker of the clock. If we had a choice of fonts, I've got a lot of different fonts in my in my vocabulary or in my computer, in my fonts list, and it would be nice to see some of them as a clock face. Um, that's just a thought. Anyway, there it is, totally free download. Again, if you're going to use this and you want to keep it as your regular clock, then bear in mind, the guy could always use a donation of some sort, yeah? There we go, and that's the uh, the aero clock. It's called again. I'll put the details up of the website at the at the end of this. Uh, I see I've got it always on top, and it can it can be a little bit annoying. Restore previous session, which.
which is that there and I'll, I'll just make a there we are I'll just copy that uh, web address so that I can put it at the end of the uh, of the video but there it is nothing fancy to it at all it's just plain ordinary you have a choice of different uh, languages as well so uh, you know if, if you speak a different language then you can choose uh, one to suit your needs lovely lovely little clock and as I say the only thing I'd like to see is an, as an add-on to it is different uh, a different font availability other than the choices that are there I mean there are some nice choices there already if you go into the clock um, there's quite a few there but they're different maybe you should be able to choose the color and then choose the, the style I don't know whether that would be majorly impossible to do as a software writer or not there it is thank you very much for listening if you like the video please give me a thumbs up and if you have any comments please feel free to leave comments on YouTube other than that thank you very much for uh, listening and I hope you've enjoyed that